A movie about Burmese democracy activist Aung San Suu Kyi is apparently not welcomed in China. There are reports that the state media watchdog has warned against any promotions for the film entitled The Lady. Netizens say trailers and reviews have now been removed from the video sharing sites. It's about the life of a woman who championed democracy in Burma. For viewers in China, though, the movie about Nobel Peace laureate Aung San Suu Kyi may not be showing any time soon. On popular video sharing sites like this one, pages with previews of the movie titled The Lady have been removed. Some people believe it's because the film centers on democracy, a subject the Chinese regime would rather avoid. Last Thursday, a blogger by the name of Cora said the Chinese regime's state administration of radio, film, and television has banned all news, promos, and footage on Aung San Suu Kyi's film, apparently because the movie contains materials that, quote, violated regulations. That ban appears to now be in place, with netizens saying they can no longer find trailers for the film on video sharing sites. The Lady stars Malaysian actress Michelle Yeoh and is directed by Frenchman Luc Benson. It tells the story of how Aung San Suu Kyi pushed for democracy and human rights in Burma through nonviolent means, but was placed under lengthy house arrest after leading her party to an election victory in 1990. Suu Kyi won the Nobel Peace Prize in 1991. She was officially freed nearly a year ago. Shanghai lawyer Li Tiantian believes the Chinese regime is banning the film because Suu Kyi has become a symbol for something it fears. The regime is always scared of these things. They don't need any particular reason. They're just scared. More specifically, this is about a person who fought for her country's democracy. Stories like these are feared by the Chinese regime. The Chinese regime heavily regulates film and media content. In 2010, the 2D version of the movie Avatar was banned because authorities felt the storyline would remind viewers of the violent forced evictions that happened extensively throughout the country.